Hi, I'm Rockhan, and today I'm going to be taking a look at some new Slime Rancher 2 news and talking about everything we know about the Ember Valley. A tweet from April 27th gave us our first real look at this biome, as it was only in the background of the trailer right at the end. According to the tweet, the Ember Valley is always rumbling, with great geysers of water on one side and lava pools on the other. This area is very hot, thanks to the volcano in its center, with some parts of it being extremely dry, and others being very lush. You'll encounter many slimes while exploring here, and we've seen confirmation that pink, boom, fire, phosphor, and crystal slimes will be returning. We can also see confirmation of the new baddie slimes in this area by looking at the ears of these baddie boom largos. This screenshot also gives us a look at the Boom Gordo, our first confirmed Gordo of Slime Rancher 2. The zones of the Ember Valley appear quite different, so let's start right next to the lava. Beginning here, we can see some big pools of lava on the surface, as well as this small lava fall. The area does have some palm trees, but as you can see, some of them are burnt. For small plants, there are a couple ferns on the ground, as well as some type of plant that hangs from the towering rocks above. Moving farther away from the lava, we can see a more lush forest. There are many more trees here, some new types of bushes, and lots of grass and moss covering the rocks. Looking to the right, we can see more of the lava zone from earlier, and a few more burnt trees. There's a cave in the center of this path with a glowing light, which could be our source for collecting lava dust which the tweet mentions is found in the Ember Valley, along with Primordial. Next, we move to a dry area of the Ember Valley. While this location doesn't have lava, it also lacks the lushness of the forest we just saw. The valley here has some tall, pointed trees, some grass, and some red vines hanging off its tall cliffs. There are some slime statues carved into the rocks, as well as some other carvings moving up the pillars. Our attention though is drawn to the center, where we can see the huge volcano that's responsible for the lava of the Ember Valley, as well as a giant storm above it. Heading to the Boom Gordo, we can see that the rocks around it are carved, and that this archway was built. The rocks also have a glossy texture, meaning they may have been formed by the heat of the lava. This area also gives us our first look at a teleporter. Heading back to the lava area, there are a few things here that I think could be the new source of primordial oil. Up here is a rainbow colored orb, and down here is a blue one. While the rainbow orb looks more like oil to me, the blue one is closer to the ground. Let me know which one you think could be our new source of oil, and what you think the other orb could be. That's all I've got for you today, so I hope you enjoyed learning more about the Ember Valley. As always, let me know your thoughts on this video in the comments, get subscribed for more Slime Rancher 2 news, and I'll see you in another one. Thanks for watching.